Hello everyone. In this video, we're going to be proving an inequality for positive integers. So n is a positive integer and we're trying to prove that 2n factorial is greater than n to the power n. I'm going to be presenting two methods and let's start with the first one. Now my first method basically involves comparing 2n factorial to n factorial, sort of. So let's go ahead and set up an expression like this. So I'm going to divide 2n factorial by n factorial. My goal is to get to n to the nth power indirectly. So let's go ahead and expand 2n factorial, start with 2n, then multiply it by 2n minus 1. And this is going to go down all the way to 1, but I want to stop uh, right before n factorial. So let's write n plus 1 and then we're going to finish with n factorial. My goal is to simplify this. So now n factorial cancels out. And we end up with an expression that's, that's a product. Obviously 2n factorial divided by n factorial is an integer. So now let's go ahead and uh, take this product and I want to write it backwards. So let's go ahead and flip it and write it as n plus 1 followed by n plus 2, dot, 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 so on and so forth. And since our first term was 2n, the last one here is going to be, not the term, the factor, last factor is going to be 2n, but I want to write it as n plus n. The reasoning behind that is I want to use the multiplication symbol uh, pi, which is kind of like the sigma, which is used for addition. So I'm going to use the pi symbol here, and this can be written as k equals 1 through n, n plus k. Great. Now notice that as k, k ranges 1 through n, you're multiplying n plus 1, n plus 2, dot, 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 all the way up to n plus n, which is the same thing as 2n. Great. Now, I want to compare this since, since, you know, when they do math proofs, they use this word a lot, n plus k is greater than n. We can write this as pi k equals 1 through n, n plus k is greater than k equals 1 through n, n. And now this is just a, basically a product of n n's, which is n to the power n, right? Okay, great. So now we were able to compare our original expression to n to the power n, which is something that we were trying to do. So now let's go ahead and write the result uh, in a simpler form. And it's going to look like this. 2n factorial divided by n factorial is greater than n to the power n. Let's go ahead and cross multiply here. This gives us 2n factorial is greater than n to the power n times n factorial. Now, remember, our goal was to prove that 2n factorial is greater than n to the power n. But we got an extra term, which is fine. It doesn't hurt. Now, we do know that n to the power n times n factorial is definitely greater than n to the power n. Why? Because n factorial is greater than 1, obviously, right? Uh, if n is greater than um, 1, n factorial is going to be greater than 1. So we can safely say that this product is greater than n to the power n. And this implies that 2n quantity factorial is greater than, in this case, actually, we should write probably greater or equal to because if n is equal to 1, then they're going to be equal. But it doesn't matter because we have to use transitive property and transitive property requires that we have to use greater than at the end, right? Because they're not both equal. So great. So this proves that 2n factorial is greater than n to the power n. And this brings us to the end of the first method. Let's go ahead and take a look at the second method. Great. Now, for my second method, I'll have a slightly different approach, and I'm going to divide 2n factorial by n to the power n this time. Okay. Now, 2n factorial can obviously be written as 1 times 2 times dot 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 all the way up to 2n, but I want to stop at n. And then the rest is going to be n plus 1, n plus 2, 
dot 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 it's going to go all the way up to 2n but again we can write it as n plus n and then just divide the whole thing by n to the power n n to the power n i want to write it as n times n times dot 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 n so now i kind of try and try to match these terms up that's why i move the n's uh, to the right so that they could match up with the n plus 1 n plus 2 all the way up to n plus n now since we have more factors in the numerator we have two n factors and at the bottom we have n factors only we can separate the first n terms or i don't know why i keep saying terms we can separate the first n factors so we can kind of split this up into two pieces and write this 2n factorial divided by n to the power n as 1 2 dot 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 n and then the rest I would like to kind of group them or pair them up like this and write it as n plus 1 over n, n plus 2 over n, dot, 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 n plus n over n. Obviously, this is go going to be uh, 2n over n, which is 2, but I'm going to leave it like that for now. So now my expression uh, becomes the following. 1 through n is just going to give me n factorial. And now notice that this expression right here can be written as 1 plus 1 over n. And then this can be written as 1 plus 2 over n. It's a product. Dot, dot, dot. This can be written as 1 plus n over n. Again, this is 2, but I just want to write it that way. Now, since n is positive, 1 over n is positive. 1 plus 1 over n is going to be greater than 1. So this is greater than 1, this is greater than 1, and this is greater than 1. All of these are greater than 1. When you multiply those two, everything together, you're going to get something greater than n factorial. So 2n factorial divided by n to the power n is going to be greater than n factorial because this is greater than n factorial and that's what it's equal to. Great. So this shows us the following. We basically arrive at the same conclusion that this 2n factorial is greater than n to the power n multiplied by n factorial and then you can safely say that this is greater than n to the power n or greater or equal to whatever so this implies 2n factorial is greater than n to the power n you could also say the following now you can look at it a little differently now we're trying to prove that 2n factorial is greater than n factorial right well, actually, that's not true. 2n factorial is greater than n to the power n. So when you divide it by um, 2n factorial, when you divide that by n to the power n, uh, you're getting something greater than 1. So that also shows you, since all the quantities are positive here, so if you get the result that a over b is greater than 1 and a and b are both positive, it just implies that a is greater than b, right? So the numerator must be greater than the denominator. And... This brings us to the end of this video. Well, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Please let me know. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. I'll see you tomorrow with another video. Until then, be safe, take care, and bye-bye.